Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. My name's Heather and today is the first day of the 12 days of Craftmas and to start us off I'm going to be showing you how to make this personalised oven mitt. So let's head over to Cricut Design Space and let's get started. So I've just opened Design Space and I'm going to create a new project And I'm just going to turn the grid on and then I want to upload a couple of images um, I've already got them here I found these on design bundles and I will link those down in the description and I just want to insert those And then I want to change these around a little bit so I want this little gingerbread man um, to be on this design and I want to get rid of this whisk so I'm going to ungroup this one and I'm going to move the gingerbread man over here and then I can delete the rest of this because I don't need that and then ungroup this one delete the whisk and bring the gingerbread man over here and I just want to ungroup these because I want to move these few elements just underneath here I want these to be with the gingerbread man and the same with these three I just want to turn this slightly and I want to select these and click attach and then I want to select all of this click attach And then resize this section to six inches wide and this sex section to three inches wide. And then I'm ready to make it. So because I'm cutting this out on HTV, I want to mirror my design and then I just want to click continue. So I've got my Cricut dial set to Eigen on. Uh, and here I've got my heat transfer vinyl and the green cutting mat. Now you want to make sure that the um, HTV is the shiny side down so the matte side will be facing up and you want to make sure that you mirror your design so that's finished cutting so now I just want to unload my mat so now I'm just going to weed my design start in the corner up here Should weed quite easily.
so now that I have weeded my design I've heated my um, Cricut Isopress up to 160 degrees Celsius and I'm just going to use my lint roller to make sure there's no fibres left on there or any hairs or glitter or anything else that it might pick up in the air and then I just want to lay my design out where I want it about there then I'm going to put my little gingerbread man down in this corner here this would make a lovely Christmas gift you could personalise it put somebody's name on there maybe do a monogram or their favourite baking recipe anything like that um, I'm just going to get my top on sheet place that over the top and then I've got my heat press on and I just want to hold that down for 15 seconds You just want to be careful when you're removing this because it will be hot can darken a little bit when you press it but it tends to disappear once it's cooled down it's still perfectly fine to use um, you want to make sure that you put it on the outside though not on the inside because you don't want this part touching any of the um, hot oven trays if they're if they're actually going to use it for baking If you're giving this as a gift you can add some utensils in there you could get something um, a little baking kit that you can put with it um, and this would make a lovely Christmas gift so thank you for watching